as our civilization becomes more and more complex, we become more vulnerable. Corporate intelligence, our infrastructure, the whole area of cyber, our military capacity is unmatched, our financial capacity is great, and people want to change that. We need to be the best in the world. We need the smartest people in the world. We need the best trained people in the world. That's all part of what we do here at Embry-Riddle. When I started looking for different colleges, the Global Security and Intelligence major popped up, and that's when I decided that that was my top choice and I didn't want to go anywhere else. I've always wanted to work in a crime lab. It's not something that people usually take credit for. Actually getting to do hands-on fingerprinting, blood splatter analysis, network security, and all of that, this is what I can imagine myself doing. Our professors have so much experience because they actually did it in those agencies. One of my favorite classes is my counterintelligence course with Professor Austin. She has turned this whole theory of counterintel into an actual practice. So they're put in a squad. They're given one piece of paper. Build a spy. Build something that fleshes out this individual. They do a surveillance exercise. They do an interview. What else can we find out about him? And they try to elicit information. We have a lot of threats in today's day and age. It's a pretty scary world out there. So on this map, you can see 1% of all the attacks happening worldwide. What we're learning here is not just the basics of network security, but also combating those threats. Over the last several years, our nation's attention has really turned towards school security. I approached a local elementary school about designing a new physical security program for the school, which was so good that the school adopted 90% of our recommendations, several of them within 24 hours of us presenting the report. We do this seed and capstone class that is called War Games. It's an international game in which you represent a country and you need to make the best of whatever crisis he decides to throw at you at the time. It's very interesting to see how the students play these games because they have to make decisions. They may not have perfect information, and just like a real policymaker. We concentrate on the melding of security and intelligence, and we use all of the best parts of each to try to prepare somebody for when they go out. CIA, FBI, NSA, DOD are just all over this campus. They're coming back to us saying, OK, this is what we need right now from you. This is the curriculum we're looking for. What we do here at Embry-Riddle is prepare students to fill this need that our country is going to have long into the future. It's an incredible experience. I'm actually doing something that I want to do and for the rest of my life.